just wanted to jump on and say hi. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to see my psychiatrist, which is what this video is about. The video you will have to watch is about me going to see my psychiatrist. And then afterwards we're going to talk about what seeing a psychiatrist is really like. I don't know what my psychiatrist is going to say tomorrow. Because I got admitted to hospital not long after seeing him. So, we'll see. So today I've got an appointment with my psychiatrist. I don't know what he's going to say because I've been impatient since I saw him. So, I don't know how this is going to go. I'm going to leave in an hour. Wish me luck. Hey, what's up you guys? I'm waiting for the bus. I left a bit later than I was planning on leaving. So I'm praying I make it on time. the 295 when you want it. I might talk to my team to see if I can ask for someone to be allocated to work with you um, to see if we can help move things on for you a bit. Yeah. yeah. Um, so like, a, I don't know if it'll be a community nurse or a support worker, um, but I, I, what I'd like to talk to the team about that. Um, when do you go back to university? September. So I had a good appointment. We're reducing my however long to 2.5 in the morning. And it's still five kilograms at night. It's ordered me to have a lithium level blood test. Which I haven't had one in nearly a year. talk a bit about what it's like seeing a psychiatrist because I know people when they go for first appointments they get a bit anxious and they kind of want to know what to expect so here's what to expect from a psychiatrist appointment so I go and see a psychiatrist once every three months I go and see a psychiatrist we talk about my education we talk about general support that I could have, we talk about how I've been doing, we talk about general things, like what's been going on in my life. And we have a chit chat about other stuff, like today we were talking about my YouTube channel, which was a fun conversation. He tried to get my URL out of me, uh, which I didn't give. <laughs> it's, on, it's on the system anyway, what my channel was called. From when I lived in Lancashire. Could just check. But you know anyway besides the point when i first went to a psychiatrist appointment i was really anxious about it but really there's nothing to be anxious about 
because they work with you they're not just going to stick you on medication they ask you if you want to, if you're willing to try medication because in the community you can't be forced medication unless you're in a community treatment order in which case then you have to take meds but if you're not on a CDL then you have the freedom to choose whether you take medication or not the psychiatrist wants me to come off haloperidol but I don't feel comfortable doing that because when I was off, when I was on the lower dose, I started hearing voices. Yeah. I don't think taking me off the antipsychotics is a good idea. But hey, we're, we're working on it together. We're lowering the dose of my haloperidol as a compromise. He wanted me to come off it because apparently you can see that I'm stiff. I don't feel stiff. I don't. I don't think I'm stiff, but apparently I look it. So there's that. And really, they're, they're just decent people. They're not, they're not all about medication. I was like, I just was talking about me doing therapy again. But specifically trauma therapy, which I'm glad about. So the psychiatrists don't just go straight to medication, they do also consider whether therapy is an option or not. It really is a shared situation, you have a say in your care. But that's all I want to say. So that's a bit about what my psychiatrist appointment looked like. I hope it helped. If it did, let me know in the comments down below. If you have any questions, ask me in the comments down below. As I said at the beginning of the video, I don't know if I said it or not. Subscribe, join the grand family, turn notifications on, hit the thumbs up button so it really does help me out. And with that, I will see you guys in my next video. Peace.